Welcome back uh, to this uh, channel. Uh, we are looking at this case. We are still on integrations of rational function uh, by partial fraction. Don't forget at the beginning we said that let what? Let uh, uh, p of x or what? Over q of x be our what? Be our rational functions. So in this case now we are having the denominator which is a q of x contain irreducible collective factor and whereby this collective factor we cannot factorize it. It's unfactorizable. Okay, so in that case now, the rational functions will be equal to what? Be equal to this expression. Be equal to a linear factor. Okay, your a is a constant, your b is a constant. Be equal to a linear factor at the numerator over the quadratic expression, which is what? Irreducible. I want to back it up with this, uh, with this uh, uh, question. Find the integral of this uh, function. So without wasting time, let's go straight to the solution of this uh, of this question. Step one. So this will be equal to let's take the fraction out. Okay, and this will be equal to what? One over here. X is common, s is common. So you can factorize the x. We have uh, x squared plus what? Plus uh, plus two. Uh, if you check this uh, this quadratic expression now, it's, it's irreducible. You can't factorize this. So in that case now, I'm going to write this one as a fraction. One over uh, x times uh, x squared plus two. This will be equal to now. The first one is a linear factor, so that will be a over this. And the second one, which is a uh, irreducible, will now become what? The first constant is a. So the next constant will be b plus what? Plus x plus what? Plus c. All over what? The quadratic uh, uh, factor. All over this. So if your constant stop at what? At b here, then the next constant will what? Will be c times the, uh, the variable you have in your question, and then plus what? Another constant. Then the next thing to do now is to multiply through by the common factor, which is what? Which is, uh, which is uh, this. And then that's the term to this. Multiply through by what? Uh, x times uh, times x squared uh, plus 2. Uh, that will give us 1 on the left. And then on the right, this fraction times the common factor. So that will give us a. Uh, this x here and this one here we cancel. So we have what times x squared uh, plus 2. Then plus, so uh, this one times the common factor, uh, b x plus c. So this and this we cancel. So times what? Uh, times x. So substitution will not work in this place. So what we are going to do is to expand this uh, expression and begin to equate the coefficients. So that's what we are going to do in this question. And that will be equal to, uh, this will be a times this, that's ax squared uh, plus 2a, okay, that's that. Then plus this one times this one, that will be bx squared. This one times this one, we have this. This one times this one, that's, uh, that's this, equal to 1. So we now have now, we can bring the x squared together, and that will be what? a plus what? a plus b times what? times x squared. Then followed by what? by this, and then followed by uh, 2a, okay, equal to 1. So equate coefficients, okay, equate the constant terms. So uh, 2a is equal to 1, so a is what? Uh, 1 by 2. If you equate the constant uh, terms, we have uh, a plus b equal to what? Equate the coefficient of x squared. If you equate this one, coefficient of x squared, we have a plus b equal to what? Equal to zero. Okay. So and this will be equal to what? We have a as half plus b equal to zero. So b is what? B is a minus half. Uh, equate the x coefficients. And on the left, you don't have x there. Equate the x coefficients. So we have. 0 equal to what? Equal to c. This is a s. The coefficient of x here is a c. Okay, so c is a 0. Okay, what again we need? So we've got in a, we've got in b, we've got in c. So we've got in all the parameters. This equal to it's my a is 1 over 2 over x plus my b is minus half. Minus half times x plus c plus uh, c is 0. All over what? All over x squared uh, plus 2 dx. So, and this is equal to what? Half integral of 1 by x, uh, dx. Here, uh, we can take the minus half outside, and that will be this times what? x by what? x squared uh, plus 2. So, what I'm going to do here, the derivative of the denominator here uh, is 2x. Here is x. So, I'm going to introduce that 2 here, okay? So, times 2 there. And that 2, I'm going to cancel that outside. That's uh, times 1 by 2 outside. So, my final conclusion with 1 by 2, integral of 1 by x is what? ln what? ln x and then minus 1 over 4 ln what? Uh, whenever your derivative, the derivative of the denominator is equal to numerator, 
it's going to be what? It's going to be LN of what? Of the denominator plus. And that finish is solution. Please uh, smash the water marks on this video if you are new on this channel. If you are a returning viewer, subscribe. That's the only way you can advance this channel. Click on like button and begin to type your comments. Okay, share the links of this video on all your social media platforms. Thank you for doing that.